Now, Chelsea is about to transform into a global hub for film buffs. From October 16th through the 19th, the Chelsea Film Festival is hosting short and feature films from all around the world. All right, Ingrid Jean-Baptiste is the festival's founder, and Jackie Ito, president of the jury. Hello to both of you. Now, tell me, how old is the event? How many years is the it's event? It's the second year. Second We're year? Here. Yeah, so it's fairly new. How did it come about? Well, it's a long story. I worked as a journalist back in Paris, and I came here about four years ago, and I had a, I took some acting classes here at the Actors Studio. Okay. Then I had a terrible car accident, so it made my career uh, completely changed uh, upside down and um, I decided to do something for the community and still have my acting uh, background and create this festival with my mom so now you, you accident I understand you were confined to a wheelchair is that correct yes that's correct yes I was uh, confined to a wheelchair for a few days I was in a coma Wow. Um, I had eight broken uh, ribs my spine was fractured and um, but it was for the better Yes. Well, so. Well, well, you look good, girl, now. So. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. So you uh, and your mom put this together. We did, yes. My mom is uh, my uh, partner uh, in this adventure, and she's uh, a wonderful guide. Uh, so we are doing this uh, together. So now yes. just tell us what makes this one a little bit different from the Tribeca or any of the other ones that we have here in the city. Yes. The, um, the Tribeca or other film festivals around town or in the United States are much different than what we are trying to um, do and present to the city of New York. We present emerging uh, filmmakers from around the world. So all of the films are from first timers, second timers, uh, they're all New York premieres. So we're, we're trying to really promote new talents. Oh. Yes. Now, Jackie, you have a background in film, understanding Glorious Bastards, correct? Mm. Yeah, I was in Glorious Bastards. Uh, what was that like? A few years back now. I, would, I mean, amazing. Like, imagine me in Paris, uh, having to audition well for Quentin Tarantino. He, he was one, you know, one of my heroes, and uh, we just sat down and talked about the script for a while, and. You know, uh -huh. next thing you know, I was on the movie. <laughs> <laughs> What's he like? What's he like? He's, uh, you know, uh, th as you imagine him, like, th you know, larger than life. Okay, that's a very good description, <laughs> I would imagine. Now, just tell us, what does the president of the jury do? Well, my role is very simple. I, I'm a big film buff, so, you know, I, mm -hmm. I feel at home. I just, I'm just going to watch movies from all over the world and, uh, you know, get to pick, uh, you know, a rising talent. So that, that's, uh, that's my focus there. And I have good help from uh, great people like Susan Batson, uh, Agnes Slav Boslo, you know, great uh, pe you know, people from, from the industry. So you know, I'm looking forward to just... Uh, See, See who's the, who, who the next uh, Jim Jarmusch <laughs> is going to be. What highlights can we expect? Mm -hmm. Either of you, what some of the highlights? Oh, the be? highlights. Well, we have films from all around the world. It's really we have uh, about 47 films this year. Uh, 13 films are in competition. Um, we have films from South Korea, Japan, uh, France. Um, everywhere so some of the highlights is actually for the opening film okay. which is uh, an Indian film and uh, Simon Boyce will be hosting yeah, that okay. opening night That's so we're very girl, excited yes. <laughs> we're very happy to have her uh, so we encourage people to come and and uh, come to see this wonderful uh, film how did you settle on Chelsea I th that was my first uh, apartment in uh, in New York so um, I decided to do something for the community for for my neighbors, for okay. yeah, and the first, and there is a theater in Chelsea called the SVA Theater. So, I just it was very simple, very logical to to us to do it for in the neighborhood. Now we also want to ask yeah. about the statue because it's the charging bull, right? How did yes, that come about? Yes. 
See, I did my so, homework. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so the statue is representing a lot to us because in, as an emerging uh, independent filmmaker, you have to be strong, you have to go forward. And that statue, that bull is, is in motion and it represents the force, the strength. And uh, so for us, it was, it was uh, logical to have this statue as part of a, a symbol of the festival and uh, and Arturo de Modica is uh, donating that bull of a ten thousand dollar value uh, to the festival That's winner huge. every year. Yeah. All right. Well, I thought they had the bull because I was a tourist. <laughs> <laughs> you make the connection there. Right? <laughs> so nice to meet you both. Let me let everyone know when the festival will be taking place. It's happening October sixteenth through the nineteenth, and as Ingrid said, Fox Five Simone Boys will be actually hosting the opening ball on October sixteenth. So nice to meet you both.